Hello my YouTube friends, Dave Wilson here. Uh, just a quick update on a couple things. I'm making progress on my projects. I've got the bamboo AMS running again. I had one of the slots, a uh, piece of filament broke in, had broken inside the unit itself, so I had to take it all apart to clear that piece of filament out. And right now it's uh, running a three color uh, print. And it's got about 57 filament changes for the whole print. It's going to take about 10 hours. But I'm making three sets of these pyramid uh, tokens for a game my daughter is trying to come up with. But um, yeah, it's pretty interesting. It, uh, it works pretty well. Uh, once in a while it'll not pull correctly, but it comes up with an error that I can correct. So it lets me know what's going on. Oh, and uh, by the way, I'm sorry, I've got a new build plate down there. It's a wham-bam. I'll try to get some more information. I'll show that it's pretty expensive. It's uh, $60 delivered. But uh, if it holds the plastic on there, it's worth it. Because I've had some of these that you know, just pop off and then it ruins the whole print. So I hate to spend 12 hours and find out I've got a, a mess on my hands. Uh, the other difficulty with AMS is this spool is too tall. You can sort of see how much taller it is. It doesn't seem like much, but the cover won't close. And then some spools are too wide. So the way to correct that is to re-spool them onto a spool that does fit. So I've been saving these spools that uh, are the correct size. And it's taken me about a month to get this rewinder built. But what it does is... It's got a guide mechanism that actually goes back and forth to guide the filament into the right, uh, I guess, te texture. It's a pretty unique design. A guy has uh, put the design on printables, and then two or three other people have come up with improvements. So. I've added all the improvements and it's working great now. But uh, So I've rewound about five of them today so that they're ready to go on the new AMS unit. The next thing I'm going to do is build an enclosure for my other bamboo printer. So it's going to add sides and a top and a door. So I've got the kit I've talked about before, but now I've got all the parts printed. It's next on my to-do list, so I'm going to start on that this afternoon. Um, well, thanks for watching. Uh, I have some more projects coming up. Um, talk to you soon. <laughs>